Hi there, Dr. Marty here, by the way, not a medical doctor. Have the sniffles today, so to be safe, I'm going to do the at-home test for this virus that's going around and show you how I do it. Very easy to use. And stay with me. Here we go. Hi, Dr. M here, by the way, not a medical doctor. Today at home, I'm going to self-test for COVID. I'm using the at-home test by Quidel. It's called Quick View at Home Over-the-Counter COVID-19 Test. It's available on Amazon and in most pharmacies. Uh, sometimes they're out of them, but Amazon is a good backup resource. And it's very easy to do. You get the results in about 10 minutes. You have to do this test two times. You take it once and then between 24 to 36 hours later, you repeat it. By doing it two times, it gives you about a 95% accuracy rate of getting an accurate, valid result. So I'm opening up the quick view test. Here inside we have the Q-tip type long applicators to stick in your nose. There's these little vials which has the solution you're going to be putting the Q-tip into. And then it has the, the sticks that actually is the test which after a minute of having the Q-tip in the solution, you're going to put this in the solution for 10 minutes, and then when you take it out, you'll have your result. So here's the uh, vial with the solution. I'm going to put it right in this little opening. I'm going to screw off the top cover and put it on the side. You have to twirl it around about a half an inch or so into your nose, each nostril, about four or five times. Please don't follow my instructions since I'm not a medical doctor nor the inventor of this. Go closely by the instructions in the insert. There is an insert in English, another one in Spanish, a fact sheet, so there's very clear directions. Please go by that, not by me to be safe. Tickles. Now I'm putting the Q-tip in the solution for 60 seconds. Alexa, set timer for 60 seconds. One minute, starting now. The 60 seconds is up for putting the applicator in the vial. And by the way, the instructions say to swirl the applicator around a little bit and then squeeze it against the uh, vial as you pull it out. You've got to follow the time limits. Now I'm opening up the actual package with the antigen test. See the arrow here? That means that goes into the vial like that. And over here in this white space, if you get a blue line, which is the control, then you look next to it. If you have a pink line, even if it's very faded, if there's a pink line next to the blue line, it's considered a positive test. Okay, I'm back. The 10 minutes are up, so I can take the test out of the vial. And by the way, before you do the test, it's suggested that you 
Wash your hands for obvious reasons. Okay, and over here on the sheet, it shows you, excuse me for moving that, it shows you how to place it. And as you can see, I have the blue line here, but I don't see a pink line next to it, which is good, obviously. On these samples, it shows you if you have the blue line and then you have a pink line next to it, whether it's dark, faded, very faded, it's still a positive test. So the good news is some symptoms I'm having is a little cold or allergies, but I will redo the test in 24 to 36 hours. You must do it two times because in the beginning you could have a very low viral load that may not show up, but if a day, two or three days afterwards it doesn't show up again, then you have not complete assurance, but 95% assurance. And if you're always, if you're in doubt at any time, check with your doctor, obviously, or go to a official testing center. Dr. Marty here with the Quidel Quick View at Home Test. Please subscribe to my channel. It would be appreciated. And also below is the link for Amazon of where to get the test. Thank you very much and have a great day.